Hello, I'm Krista Crum, here today with Lillian Coral, Chief Data Officer for the City of Los Angeles. Can you tell us a little bit about your role and responsibilities with the City of Los Angeles? I work within the Office of Mayor Eric Rossetti, and my role oversees three areas. First, um, I manage our open data program, and then we also help to ensure that the departments are using information as an asset. And then lastly, we oversee digital services, um, and in particular, thinking about the user experience in digital services. Can you tell me a little bit about GeoHub? So GeoHub is our, new, our newest platform. It's meant to kind of take our open data and transparency initiative beyond um, transparency and onto that next phase where we're really using data and putting it to work. And when we looked around the city, one of the most common data types was GIS data. And data sharing for us is what leads us to greater collaboration, insights, and innovation. You know, the average Angelino who's not going to build a map, or not going to do analysis on their own, um, they've got a lot of really important information about what the city's doing and how the city's improving. For you know our really expert GIS analysts, we give them a lot of data and, and sort of open the GeoHub to real tools that they can use the data with. It's allowing us to provide decision makers information that is much more actionable. For our policy staff, there's a lot of curated maps. And for our developers, we, we love people in Los Angeles and, and startups using our data to develop um, new concepts and ideas, so we make all of the data easily accessible and consumable by other applications. Can you tell me about some major community initiatives that you're supporting with GIS? Well, we're doing a range of initiatives, especially our office is, is really committed to furthering our clean stat approach, which is ensuring that Los Angeles is the cleanest city in America. We're also right now focused on transportation, um, vision zero and safety, issues like homelessness um, and crime, um, just to make sure that we also have the safest city. There's nothing like putting data on a map and really being able to engage with decision makers, stakeholders, um, and then with the public, being able to communicate some really complex data has been a really great bridge to engaging um, and connecting with the community. So are you using story maps at all for any of those? Communication is critical and story maps really help us kind of share it with the public in a different way. The contextual component is probably one of the most valuable um, pieces of, um, of insights that, that we get from GIS.